connu. Uh, yeah, it was too. Um, yeah, it was it was tough. I mean, they did a great job, obviously defensively, and um, made it tough on us all night. And you know, you tip your cap to them. They're they're the team they are for a reason, and um, did such a great job doing uh, you know playing against us tonight and, and keeping us contained. Jared, you've always talked about lessons learned. What's the lesson learned from this experience in this game? So many things. So many things. I think um, you can take away so many. So many different things as far as experience and um, different situations and um, different approaches and uh, there's just so many different things. How much does it hurt right now? I know it's still a few minutes after, but how much does it hurt? Kills, kills, and it, it, it hurts. It hurts me so much just knowing how well our defense played and, and against that that team against Tom to play that well defensively and. Um, us not hold up our end of the bargain, and, and, and it's, um, no, it's, it's, you know, our job to score points, so we didn't do that tonight. Jerry, do they play more zone? Uh, they played a lot of zone, yeah, they did. Jerry, John said this loss, how does it compare to anything you've ever experienced in football? Well, the, the toughest loss I've ever had, I mean, it's, uh, it, it kills, it's, it's terrible, and, um, you know, there are some, some some good things you can take from it, but right now there's there's nothing. I mean, it's the game. I wish I would have played better. I wish we would have played better on offense, offensively as a whole. Um, you know, I wish I could have had a million plays back, but uh, there's nothing you can do about it. You just got to learn and move forward. Which one? Uh, what are you saying, wide open? Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, he was running uh, kind of somewhat of a runoff route, clearing out coverage, and they dropped him. Um, they, they, they let him run through free and um, was kind of surprised that he was that wide open. And uh, tried to get to him as quickly as I could, and uh, unfortunately it was too late. 13 to, 13 to 3, did you ever think that the Super Bowl would, game would play out the way it did? No, I don't think so. I think we obviously expected to score a lot more points than that, and um, it sucks the way it turned out. Uh, but you know, I'm going to use it as a learning experience and be better because of it. Jared, John said, I'm numb. I got out coached. What's your reaction to that? You know, he's he's been so good for us all year, and you know, I, I feel his pain, but for him to say something like that, he's we wouldn't be here without him. We wouldn't have won 13 games in the regular season without him. We wouldn't you know, have done all the things, great things we did on offense without him. Um, you know, we wouldn't have the culture we have without him. We wouldn't have any of the people here without him. I mean, he's done so many, so many good things for this whole organization that um, you know, I hope I hope he knows that. And, and, and we're, we're right, so behind him. Couldn't be more behind him. Jared, where were your nerves at going into this game this afternoon? How did you feel leading up? I felt great. I felt great. I felt excited, and um, again, ultimately, we just didn't get it done. Did, did they do anything differently than you would have seen in the film or expected? Um, yeah, but that's that's the game. I mean, that happens every game, and I think that's kind of something that they do well is they're able to mix it up well and uh, keep us guessing. And especially early on, we're able to you know we had completely guessing. Um, no, I don't think anything took us by surprise, but anytime you go through it, you definitely know what's coming and have more of a experience to it. Uh, that's my fault, man. I just, I can't, I can't put us in that situation. You know, I, I knew they were bringing, um, Cover zero blitz there and try to hit Brandon on a go ball and uh, Gilmore was too far off for me to make that decision and um, bad decision by me and and I gotta be done. I, everything. I mean, they were, they were doing such a good do job defensively mixing it up on us and um, we were having a hard time moving the ball and, and that happens. And, you know, you think at some point you're going to come out of it, as we have all year, and, and, and we almost did. I mean, we were moving the ball there well at, at times in the game, and kind of just one play, just one play. We couldn't get one play. We couldn't get one play, and, and, and they did. And, and it's, it's, it's up to them, man. I mean, they played so well, and um, 
you know, we know what type of offense we are, and, and for them to do what they did to us tonight is impressive. Tom's had a lot of Super Bowl magic. He wasn't terrific, but he was okay. But what do you think about I don't. I wasn't watching him much. He did a great job, though, and, and uh, won the game. It's all, it's all that matters. He won the game and did a great job. Uh, that's not my decision. I thought he was a great player, and um, you know, love to get him the ball, but for whatever reason, that's, that's not my decision. Um, no, I, th I, th I mean, you're, you're just you are numb in a way where like you're trying to process it all, but that it? we know what happened. I mean, we, get, we got outplayed. We got completely outplayed. And, like I said, for an offense like we know we're capable of being, for them to do what they did to us is so impressive. And you tip your cap to them, but at the same time, you know, we, we left so much out there on the field that's so hard to take right now. And, and you know, I'm, I'm, I'm mad at myself. You know, I wish I would have done things differently. I wish I could have back and made extra plays, but all stuff I can learn from and um, use moving forward.